Welcome to my zone online school. My name is teacher Mutsa. Get your education booklet in our daily newspaper, street sales, or at your school every Monday to Thursday for pre-primary up until grade three. The lessons are for listening or watching online. Inside the newspapers, there is an insert of the lesson booklet. Please cut the top of the lesson booklet with a pair of scissors and fold it for ready to use. But there is more. We are also available on our online platforms, MyZone and Zoshi Facebook pages, and in addition, our website, Zoshi Online. to my zone online school my name is teacher Mutsa and thank you so much for joining me today our theme this week is my body and before we get into any lessons boys and girls it's important for us to sanitize <laughs> so please take your sanitizer and we are going to sing our special sanitizing song. Sanitize every day so the germs can stay away. Sanitize every day so the germs can stay away. Yay! Good job, everyone! Now we are ready. For today's lesson, we will be talking about the letter length and body parts. For our first exercise, boys and girls, let us turn to page 24. On page 24, you can see that we have a special letter and the sound that this letter makes is <sighs> everyone let's say <sighs> <sighs> very good boys and girls so now we are going to try and find things in our classroom or at home that start with the sound Let's take a look at the classroom. Now, the first thing that I'm sure you can see that starts with the sound is my hat. It is my special hat. And when I'm feeling very happy, I put it on. Everyone, let's say hat. Hat. Very good. The next thing that is on your body already are your hands. Everyone, let's say hands. Hands. Very good. Then I have a special one that starts with and this one is called a hashtag. Everyone, let's say Hashtag, hashtag. So we have three things so far. We have a hat, hands, and hashtag. So now I want you to go around your house and look for things that start with <sighs> Remember boys and girls, the sound <sighs> is very soft and very quiet so when you say don't make your voice deep <laughs> so we are going to also show you how to make the big letter and the small letter but first 
let's go back into our exercise and see what they want us to do. In our exercise, we are being asked to color the pictures that make the sound <sighs> So, let us take a look at each part. The first one that we can see is an ear. Everyone, let's say ear. Does an ear start with <sighs> No, I don't think so. The next one that we can see is a boy, but we are seeing his head. Does the word head start with <sighs> Yes, it does. So we are going to color the head. The next one that we can see is the word or the picture of a hand. Does the word hand start with <sighs> Yes, it does. So you need to color that as well. Then the last thing that we can see is an eye. Does the word I start with <sighs> No, it doesn't. So, we are only going to color the head and the hand. Remember, boys and girls, when we are coloring, we need to make sure that we stay in the lines and leave no open spots. You must color either going up and down or from side to side. Now, let me show you how you are going to practice writing the letter Let's take a look at the board. Now, I want you to take your finger and you are going to start at the top. Very good. You are now going to go down a straight line and then you make another straight line very good and a cross and this is how we make the big the small ha is very easy we just go let's go together down up and round so i want you to practice the big letter and the small letter. Have fun. I will see you soon. And we will be back after our advert break. Do you have children in the age range of five to six years and want to participate in our school booklet program? Please contact us on 081 and we will put you on our distribution list for the attention of pre-primary schools. Topics include family, summer, culture, traditions and houses, transport and communications, occupations, autumn and more. We distribute countrywide in over seven different languages. For our exercise this time, please can we take a look at page 25. On page 25, we have some naughty, naughty worms. And it is going to be our job, boys and girls, to color the short ones. Now remember, short can also mean little. So we don't want the long ones. We want the small ones or the little ones. Let me show you with my hands what short means. Now, short means that they are small or little. You can see that the size is not very big at all. But the long ones become a big, big size. So big that sometimes we can't even see where it starts and where it ends. So remember, short and long so you are going to color the short ones i'm going to leave that one for you now we're going to go to page 26 
On page 26, we have a dolly or a doll. Now this doll is, uh oh, missing some body parts. And it is going to be our job to color the body parts after we draw them. So we need to find them first and look at the doll carefully. Let's take a look at the first one. The first doll has all her body parts. She has two hands, two arms, two eyes, a nose, two ears, but she has one leg. So it is our job to draw the missing leg. The next doll has two hands, two legs, but uh-oh, she is missing her head. So we need to draw the missing head. The rest of the two that are at the bottom, I want you to take a good look at them and you are going to draw the missing body part. I am going to fill in the one for the beginning on the board. Let's take a look. Now, I am going to do this one here. As I said before, she has two arms, a head, but only one leg. So I am going to try and draw her other leg. Now a leg starts from her skirt going down and the other side as well. But I must not forget her feet and her toes. And now she has another leg. Yay, well done teacher. So, you are going to have so much fun filling in the missing body parts. So, the first thing you're going to do, boys and girls, on page 25 is color the small or short worms, all of them. And then, you're going to go to page 26 and you're going to fill in the missing body parts on our doll. Take your time, please have fun, and I will see you just now after our advert break. Follow us on My Zone Facebook Active Kids to watch your daily lesson and other fun activities with Zoe and Zoshi. Boys and girls, we have now come to the end of our lesson and I had so much fun with you today. I hope you also had fun with me. So now that we are done with our lesson, I want you to remember that anytime you get stuck in the middle of an exercise, please ask for help. Now, let us sanitize since we are at the end. Remember boys and girls, this is how we sanitize. We rub inside our hands, around our hands, in between our fingers, and on our wrists. Make sure that your hands are dry before you touch anything else. Now that we have come to the end, it is time to say goodbye. And I want Sashi to join us. Sashi, can you come so we can say goodbye to our friends? Oh, there you are. So Sashi, we want to say goodbye. Are you ready? Wonderful. Let's sing our special goodbye song. Goodbye, goodbye, it's time to say goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye, it's time to say goodbye. Bye! Our online school will help you along the way. Find us at www.zoshi.online and download the booklet. Follow us on Facebook to never miss a video. Subscribe to our Zoshi Telegram channel if you want to receive daily updates. Proudly sponsored by Ministry of Education, Arts and Culture, Namibian Community Trust, UNICEF for Every Child, My Zone Online School and Amos Meerkat Syllabus.